others representatives of the people, we have been asked, I have been asked by Toledo West constituency to be present. And that is why I was happy when I was invited by the chairman of the Public Accounts Committee to participate in the meeting. I made every effort, I sacrificed the time and the resources to be at the meeting yesterday because I expected that the least that could have been done was that as an elected representative that the courtesy could have been extended for me to at least listen and when the time was appropriate for me to you know, uh, participate in the session. So ladies and gentlemen, we need to understand that these people are not serious. That, that, is, that is my conclusion, that these members of the government side are not serious. Man, they were elected on a mandate to be accountable to the people of Belize. And we have a responsibility. And I will tell you, I am totally disappointed when the Honorable John Saldiva will speak about, oh, well, we could go back to, 19, um, to 1998, the period of the PUP. Man, the people elected us. We need to move forward. Let us stop playing the blame game. We need to, if there were wrongs, let us correct it. Let us move ahead. The people of Belize deserve better. And we need to move ahead. I, as I said, when you look at the total mismanagement of funds, in my constituency, the roads are totally neglected. We don't have equipment for the Ministry of Works. The streets are in the worst condition. The roads, the farmers' roads in San Marcos, in San Benito Poite, in Big Falls, and I can go on and on, 53 villages in the Toledo district. But yet they can spend the money without having to account for it.